Hi there, Halu here. I finally got my Z Flip back after sending it to Samsung for a fix. It came back brand new and I spent most of my night setting it to my liking. As I mentioned before, I'll probably be using it primarily as a vlogging camera from now on. My sister and I had a simple dinner picking up some rolls from Yama Seafood and eating leftovers from the other night. I decided to wind down the night by playing some AFK Journey, my latest obsession. My girlfriend hates that I play this. Good morning, today is April 2nd on a lovely Tuesday morning. I got up early this morning at 5 a.m. and did my duty. Worked on the vlogs for 3.3 to 3.10 and uh, pretty much put most of it together. Now I'm just going in, editing the parts out. I say a lot of ums and I say a lot of uh and like, but you know, but it's like, you know, and um. So yeah. I do, I do a lot of that and I'm going in through the videos and just editing that out because it does take a lot of time when I fill in the gaps with a bunch of, I wouldn't even call them transition words, they're just words of holding thought when I can just stay silent as I just did. Anyways, it was a good two hour session just editing through my videos. I'm feeling a lot better even though I'm not completely a week behind. I am doing it. I am doing it and I feel good that I'm doing it. It's getting done. I'm not wasting time. I'm getting up on time. I'm feeling awake. I did sleep a little late yesterday around 12 o'clock but that's just because like I've been playing uh, AFK Journey. Yeah, you might have seen some ads for those. It's a really good game. If you like RPGs, if you like auto chess, TFT, Dota Underlords, that kind of stuff, it's the game for you. It's a really good RPG. The graphics are beautiful. It runs very smooth. And the transition from phone to desktop, seamless. So if you're looking for a new game to play, I highly recommend you checking it out. I'm not a game reviewer or a sponsored ad or anything. It is it is just a really fantastic game. A lot of fun. But today looks like it's going to be a good day. I am gonna be a little busy at work today since it is the first of the month. And usually there's a lot more work to do in the first of the month, on the first of the month. Then once I get home, I promised myself that I would edit just a little bit more. Even if it's like 30 minutes, just put in a little tiny bit of work. And there was this uh, new Lethal Company style game that my friend sent me. Um, the game is $7 on release, but I think for the first 24 hours, if you claim it, it is free. We all claimed that and um, I actually got them all into AFK Journey yesterday where we were supposed to play that game. It's called Content Warning. I think you're supposed to like film scary spooky things with your friends. It's I don't know how it works but we'll check it out tonight maybe. But I promised myself I'd do a little bit of editing before that and then I plan to just maybe play some of that tonight. Um, but yeah, I got my friends into AFK Journey, uh, the ones that I actually like play games with pretty often. They like it, and um, yeah, <laughs> I'm pretty excited that they're playing. Also, if you haven't noticed, I got my Z Flip back. It is awesome being able to film myself and see the perspective. Yeah, I'm not gonna film with iPhone anymore, at least not selfie stuff. Uh, it's just not as efficient. I'm sorry, iPhone. I'm sorry, Apple. Make a flip phone, yo. <laughs> uh, but today looks like it's gonna be a pretty good day. I'm gonna get started with work and I will see you all at lunch. Hello, it is now lunchtime and I got a very special treat for lunch. Spaghetti, shrimp, and steak, and I'll adore you. The spaghetti was from the other night and then the steak was from when I had it with my girlfriend. That was the same night, actually. Um, but yeah, we had this in the fridge, so I just took it to lunch. Today has been pretty chill. It is hot today, which honestly California needs because it's been raining like crazy and cold. So the warmth actually feels pretty good today. Uh, work's been busy, just kind of like nonstop doing my thing, doing all my tasks. Um, 
but it's been a good day. I'm getting a little tired and I feel like after I eat this, I might be like kind of slumped, but you know, we got a couple more hours. Put that in and go home, shower, eat, and edit for a little bit and plan is still the same just kind of work on editing the vlog and then play some games to end the night looking forward to eating this so i'm gonna get right into it catch y'all later for dinner i had some more of the beef stew mixed in with cilantro and some red onions ate that with a side of rice good morning it is april 3rd 2024 i am headed to work after going to the gym this morning I didn't do too much because I'm actually experiencing a sort of flare-up with my where my uh, degenerative disc is. So I think well, some of my nerves are kind of acting up in those areas. So my back in that area is sort of extremely sore. I don't know if it was because I, I was carrying my nephew. Um, if that's the case, then maybe I shouldn't have children. But. I don't know, suddenly it's extremely sore. Perhaps I slept wrong the past couple of nights. Um, but I'm feeling a little bit of a flare up and yesterday it was sort of difficult to deal with uh, when going to sleep. So at the gym this morning, all I really did was cardio. The running, walking, jogging machine where you have to do that as always. And then I just walked on the treadmill for about 30 minutes or so. Um, and then afterwards I went into the massage room and just used the Theragun and just worked on my leg and those areas that are that is being affected and uh, I feel better I don't feel completely healed or anything like I said maybe I just slept wrong the past couple of nights but uh, I'm feeling better it's uh, more manageable this morning throughout the entire time at the gym I was playing AFK journey and there isn't much else left to do because I'm limited by my power level but I still play the game anyways because it's fun there's like other modes that don't really require your team to be a certain level um, and I'm just having a blast playing this game it is so fun and yes it is a monetized gacha cash grabber engine but they make it manageable. They make it fun. They make it worth playing. And I'm, I'm actually enjoying my time playing the game. And uh, I got some of my closest friends to also play with me. So that's been a lot of fun. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much what I'm all about right now. Some AFK journey. Because of that, I didn't work on editing last night. I was too occupied with min-maxing, as I usually do. And uh, it's okay, because I did work a good amount on it yesterday morning, and also tomorrow is another day for me to uh, work on editing it some more. But otherwise, uh, yesterday was a pretty good day. Today looks like it's gonna be about the same. Shouldn't be too different. Just another day at work, just another day of uh, doing what I gotta do. And um, I am finally home alone. And what that means is that I have to start taking care of myself again. Which I like and also, damn, I can't play I can't play or edit as much. But that's okay. Uh, I, I enjoy cooking for myself. I enjoy uh, trying out different recipes. My sister, before she left yesterday, got me a bunch of groceries. So I'm excited to go home and experiment with what I can make. Until then, I got work to do. See you guys all at lunch. Peace. Good afternoon. It is now lunchtime. I just finished talking to my other employer. It was a good, quick meeting about our work, our tasks. As I said before, I kind of get nervous about doing it, but it's been better these days because, um, you know, I'm getting like, not praised, but I'm getting uh, confirmation that my work is helping out a lot and it feels very good. You know, when you do things for people and they don't tell you thank you or like things look good and you kind of just left like, uh, did I do a good job? Do you like what I did? Is there anything I can change? But um, I've been getting confirmation that things are working out. So I'm pretty happy about that. Uh, making me less nervous to have our weekly chats 
Um, so today I got more of the beef stew that my sister made. I thought I wouldn't have enough rice because I ate a bunch of it yesterday, but it's looking pretty good. And I am hungry, man. I was like growling this entire morning. I also don't know if I should keep my facial hair. I feel like it's getting a little long, but I kind of like the way it looks. It makes me feel older. <laughs> And I don't look like a little boy, but work has been pretty busy. Um, it always sucks when you're like super busy and you're not able to progress in your own tasks, but you're like busy. So the day's going by fast. So it's like a yin and yang thing. There's good and bad in it. So day's going by pretty fast, still energized. Plan to go home, cook some dinner for myself. Hopefully get to some, some creative work before I get succumbed by the lust of AFK journey. The game is way too good. Gonna enjoy my lunch. I will talk to you all later. Peace. Dinner was pretty easy. Still had some beef stew, so I decided to finish that up. I took some old broth and added whatever veggies that was left in my fridge and made some soup. Good morning, it is Thursday, April 4th, 2024. The days are going by pretty fast this week. I can't believe it's Thursday already. It's a gloomy morning. Pretty nice out, not too hot. The past two days have been hot. California has the most bipolar weather. It's even more bipolar than my mood swings. Got up at five this morning and really didn't want to leave my warm bed, but I figured I gotta get up anyways. And I stretched first because as I've mentioned that I've been feeling a lot of uh, my pain in the back and it's mostly due to my nerves being caught up in my like, spine disc being uh, protru pro protruding out so when the spine is like our spine discs are like this right and then mine is like this because I got a degenerative disc and it's like slowly getting worse um, but it pretty much pokes outward and then my nerve that is trying to come from like the top to the bottom of my foot. So literally connecting to the back of my neck all the way down to my foot, that nerve is being sort of poked on. And when that nerve gets poked on, it causes pain to pretty much go from my back, like lower back to my butt, down my leg, onto my foot. So the pain is sort of kind of like maybe at a scale of in between 20 to 40 depending on like how much stretching I've done. Um, so this morning I stretched a little bit and it helped out. It's probably down to like a 15, 20% right now. Um, I'm judging that based off of 100% which it was like two years ago where my housemates had to take me to the emergency room and it was a whole bad situation. I couldn't even get, I couldn't even lay down on my bed. I couldn't even sleep. I was just dying in pain. I couldn't walk. It, it was completely bad. Uh, luckily I had a friend um, pretty much ease me back into normal life um, by strictly doing physical therapy, massages and like that kind of stuff. So. I stretched this morning and then like I hopped onto my computer, but because I've been so occupied with this game AFK journey, it's so good. Oh my God, I, I have never been hooked on a gacha. Like I've played gachas and I've been pretty good about being a free to, free to play player. But this one, for some reason, has got me a little, a little addicted. A little addicted, for sure, for sure. Uh, something about it just really sort of resonates with the games I like to play. Um, it makes me feel good when I progress. So yeah, I'm a little occupied with this thing right now, but I did work on editing just for a little bit. Got most of it done. Um, and then, uh, yeah, I'm just going to try to chill on the game for most of today. I have a lot of work at, 
at work that I need to be doing. Um, I also have a lot of like outside of work projects that I need to like get to. So yeah, I need to chill on this AFK journey for a little bit. I mean, I could do my dailies and whatever, but I just got to chill on the progression a little bit because it's taking up a lot of time in my day. Um, but today looks like a pretty good day. I love it when it's a little cloudy and gloomy. I'm betting the sun is going to come out a little bit later. But until then, I will see you all at lunch. Peace. Good afternoon. It is 1 p.m. and you know, that means it is lunchtime. Aw, yeah. Today's been pretty quick. I've just been really busy with my tasks. Getting a lot more things done now that I'm at an okay place in the AFK journey. Um, there's not too much to do, so I'm just focusing on what I really need to do, which is great because you know when, a, when there's a new game, all you want to do is get ahead and now that I'm at a good place in the game, I can just kind of chill on it. Um, today for lunch, I have a pretty normal lunch. Since I'm home alone, I'm just cleaning up whatever's in the fridge and we still had some spare ribs and sin choy still in the fridge. So I just put that together, packed it up and called it a day. However, when I do get home, I do have to cook some dinner and prepare. Oh, tomorrow's Friday. That means we're going to go out to eat. So I just have to cook dinner for myself tonight, uh, which is great because there is a lot of things I need to do. I had a friend send over a 3D model, which he is a beginner at modeling and wanted me to take a look at smoothing out some of the edges and uh, I've been delaying on that because of AFK journey. Sorry. Um, but otherwise, today's been a pretty good day. Normal, not too busy. Um, yeah, I'm gonna get to my lunch and we will see what I get into tonight. Peace. Again, I made an easy dinner, mixed together a salad pack from Trader Joe's and heated up some cha shu with eel. Whenever I cook for myself, it's always extravagant. I really do enjoy cooking. At night, we played that game I mentioned earlier this week, Content Warning. Here's some clips from it. Oh shit. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> Dustin, you wanted to help me? Mikey! <laughs> Oh, I'm okay. Oh, we're okay. We're okay. Oh shit! Yeah, let's go. Throw it in there. Oh, this nice. came out. Let's watch a movie. Ooh, that's sick. Sit down. I have a movie. Sit down. Monsters, Widow Willy. I'm Widow Willy doing the Gwitty. Check it out. Oh shit. <laughs> Oh shit! Justin, you wanna help me? Mikey! 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 What is that? Yo, it's the f uh, ceiling Usi. Um, what the f is that? Oh shit! Hey, I'm Charlie, and you're watching Jackass. Hello, good morning. It is Friday. April 5th, 2024, just a little bit after 7 a.m. I just finished with my morning gym session and I am feeling a lot better. I woke up with a problem that's been happening with my back and my leg and the whole past couple of days. I think now that I have this symptom, uh, it's going to be a sort of, not consistent, but like every so often sort of a thing. Um, I know that when I first got it, it was something that is going to be with me for the rest of my life. And I just have to try and prevent as many flare-ups as possible. And it's a big reason as to why I started going to the gym so often. I used to rock climb a lot and I kind of don't anymore because when I fall during rock climbing, I can seriously reverse tons and tons and tons of work I've been putting in to relieve the problems. Um, spine, those areas, those discs are extremely sensitive, so any sort of, I guess, uh, 
adjustment or movement to them in the wrong position is going to make my pain very immense with my nerves. It's why I really started going to the gym very often, um, maybe two years ago. In the beginning, I really didn't like lifting weights. I wouldn't mind using some of the machines to like kind of push um, a little bit. As for now, I really do enjoy lifting. I don't lift to like a heavy power lifter degree. It's just more so maintaining my muscles, maintaining strength in most of the areas of my body, and really just trying to stay healthy for the most part. But um, I think when I lift, I also sometimes push myself a little bit too hard, which may be even causing the flare-ups. So I try my best to kind of dial it down after I start feeling that, which is why I've just been doing cardio this week, um, just to try to loosen up some of the muscles, um, maybe open up some of the, I don't know how the body works, I'm not a biology major, but just open up some of my, get a little loose pretty much, get a little because usually when I flare up it's tightness in those areas that's kind of constricting the nerve so I just try to get a little loose um, doing a lot of cardio and then I go into the massage room massage myself for like 15 minutes and I feel a lot better when starting my day I still feel a little tingly some numbness on my uh, big toe kind of coming down from my back uh, down my butt to the big toe but it is a lot better than when I was uh, waking up this morning. And I am so glad I went to the gym because I was debating whether I should go or not because I was so tired. But very happy to have gone. Uh, it's looking to be a pretty lovely day. And when I say lovely, I mean it's, it's raining and clear skied. So today is Friday, we're gonna go out to eat. Don't know what yet, but looking forward to having some non-homemade food because I think we all deserve to splurge a little every so often. All right, until then, see you later. Lunch was a complete failure that day. We usually go to Shinsengumi and there's no wait, but that day it was packed. We tried to get a seat, but eventually had to get takeout instead. I wasn't too hungry after all that, so I just snacked on my side of beef and rice until later that night. Once it was dinner time, I boiled two eggs. Did you know that you can use an electric kettle to boil eggs? So efficient. Put my soup on the stove and air fried some chicken from Trader Joe's and had ramen with a side of quote unquote karage for dinner. Good morning, it is Saturday, April 6th, 2024. I did absolutely nothing after work because had to cook dinner, had to make lunch for today, and honestly, I was pretty pooped after that. So, along with that, I pretty much just played AFK Journey until I fell asleep, which I've been doing every night for the past couple of nights. I'm serious, guys. If you want an addictive game that you can play anywhere, whether desktop or mobile, play AFK Journey. I'm not even sponsored by them. And that game has got me hooked. I did not wake up this morning. My pain, I don't even know what to call it. I'm just gonna call it back pain from now on. My back pain, which shoots down my entire leg, was pretty bad this morning. Um, I did not want to leave my bed. Uh, it was difficult to leave my bed. Even to get up this morning to get ready for work and hop into the shower, it was a little painful. So, yeah, I'm uh, looking forward to going to work and just using the massage gun all day, just working on those areas all day. Because after using the massage gun, it like feels a lot better, but it'll flare up again, like out of nowhere, which is super annoying because, you know, I feel like if I'm putting in work, stretching and massaging and, you know, just trying to relieve it, it should at least be a little relieved, but for some reason it's getting worse. I think that it flares up every so often. Maybe when I am feeling a little sick. I'm not sick like 
I don't have a cold or a cough or anything, but I can kind of tell when I'm feeling a little under the weather. Uh, in Cantonese, we call it yi hei. It pretty much translates into hot breath, but it's sort of when your body is like lacking nutrition, you have a little bit more phlegm, you, uh, your nose is a little dry, such and such. So I feel that maybe I might be a little yi hei, and because of that, I am having a flare-up. That is what I'm dealing with, but anyways, today at work should be pretty chill. Uh, I'm just gonna try to accomplish a little bit more tests, then I get off early and it's the weekend, um, and with my day off, I'll try to do everything that I didn't do this week. So that's on the agenda. I will see you all at lunch. Peace. At work, my coworker got me an Egg McMuffin. Don't hate me for this, but I try not to eat a lot of carbs since I always have rice. So I always eat the muffin and just eat the egg and sausage. It is now 1 p.m., which means it is lunchtime. And you know, as I say that, I start to think about, <clears throat> are these vlogs even worth it? Are these vlogs even worth like putting effort into editing every week and filming and talking to my camera every day? And like, is it worth it? And I think at the end of it, it is worth it because I myself get to look back on thoughts and opinions that I once had even just seconds ago, right? We are ever changing. We're always going to have, we're always going to be thinking something else. We're always going to be feeling one type of way or another on a certain day. Those days don't really reflect on the entire being of an individual and yeah, it's. I think it's important to even just document these small moments that I have with myself in a car during lunchtime at 1 p.m., right? I think it's important. But is it a lot of effort to like do? Yeah. Every week I gotta put together a vlog and I'm like so far behind already and I feel all this like guilt of not doing it when I wanna just play AFK Journey all day. Yeah, I do feel like it's a little bit overwhelming. But I think at the end of the day, it is extremely worth it because I get to edit these videos and reflect on thoughts and opinions that I've had just weeks ago, just hours ago, right? Um, Cause when I look back on these videos that I edit, I'm always like, oh, that guy didn't know what he was about to get himself into. Or that guy, was smart about the decisions that he made, you know? You can look back and like judge your own character. It's sort of like if you play games, you play like fighting games or shooting games or whatever, and you record your matches, you're able to look back on what you did right and what you didn't do correctly. And that's sort of what vlogging is like when you just talk kind of freely without certain expectations of your reflections on life and whatever, right? You just kind of like are able to look back at who you are, what you've done. And yeah, I think that these small little moments in my car to myself are pretty important. So even though I'm so far behind and I keep talking about this, I know on these vlogs and editing them, I think they're important to have and, um, you know, I, I should keep doing it. I am telling myself now, while I edit this, keep doing it. It is worth it. Anyways, today I have a very beautiful lunch. It is some Brussels sprouts that I seasoned with just salt and pepper and orange chicken from Trader Ming's. That's like the non racist Chinese version of Trader Joe's. I love it. It's it's delicious. Um, it's frozen orange chicken that I air fry and I stir fry with some orange chicken sauce. And it's good. It is really good chicken. So if you haven't tried it yet, please go try it. It's delicious. Day's been good, getting work done, but also playing AFK Journey on the side, progressing, not hitting any blocks. That always feels good. Um, yeah, today's been a really good day. I'm also very energetic because I am drinking my second cup of coffee, which I only I usually only drink one, and that's because I don't want to have more caffeine after 12 p.m. so I can sleep earlier. 
but it's the weekend for me, so I can enjoy another cup of coffee. Why not? Anyways, I'm going to get into this lunch. Um, hoping maybe to visit the chiropractor if they have time after work because this flare up is like really kicking my ass. Um, but if not, I'm just going to, um, yeah, just try to stretch it out. Honestly, that's all I could really do. All right. Talk to you later. Peace out. At home, I mixed up some rice, stir fried some Brussels sprouts, and put together Trader Ming's Kung Pao chicken, another one of my favorites. And of course, I needed to add a fried sunny side egg as well. Hello and good afternoon. Today is April 8th, 2024 on a beautiful Sunday afternoon. I am currently headed over to my cousin's cousin's house because I guess I always thought that your cousin's cousin's was your second cousin. But I think it's actually if you have a kid and your cousin has a kid and so those kids play, that's your second cousin. I always thought like your cousin's cousin was your second cousin, but I guess it's just your cousin's cousin or maybe cousin in law. I don't know. Anyways, I'm headed over to their house. We're gonna get some lunch today. Uh, I believe we're having some izakaya, yakitori, skewers sort of a situation. And uh, I'm pretty excited because it's been a long, long time since I've hung out with this relative. Anyways, I'm pretty excited to hang out with her. Uh, I'm also meeting her boyfriend for the first time. I'm gonna see what that guy's like. But most importantly, I'm excited to catch up with her. We pretty much grew up together. She is a year older than me. And after high school, which we attended the same one. Um, we're just trying to figure out life together and trying to see like what we should make of ourselves. Um, obviously, we live very different lives and um, that's always the thing. It's like when you're close to someone, seeing them grow, seeing them become someone, seeing them become who they currently are, is always an, ama is always an amazing journey to learn about um, so I'm excited to see what she's been up to the past couple of years and even more excited to enjoy the nice cuisine with them um, last night was uh, it's pretty busy it's pretty busy I went to the Cairo after work and got myself uh, kind of adjusted kind of uh, decompressed did a little massaging and I feel better but I still feel that pain I'm hoping it is just a soreness to it now um, as opposed to a sharp sort of uh, pinching stabbing pain so I did some like hula hoop hip circular motions earlier and it's kind of like going away um, but yeah I think feel, once I like once I wake up and get out of bed I'm gonna feel like extremely sore and it's going to be a little bit painful in the morning but once I get up start doing my thing do a little stretches I start feeling better so I'm hoping these next few days it goes away because I'm going to Coachella with my girlfriend I don't know how I'm gonna survive if my leg hurts and I can't dance I am known as one of the best dancers out of all my friend groups. You can ask anyone who knows me and has gone to a show with me. I love to dance, but I am feeling some, uh, some limitations and uh, I'm hoping that I at least have like an 80 to 90% recovery before going to Coachella because I will not be able to be on my feet all day if this pain persists. Got that done yesterday. Came home, had to cook dinner for myself, chilled a little bit, and then by then it was already like 9.30 and I was like pooped and I was like, all right, well, I'm just gonna game. After lunch today, I hope to go home, maybe finish up a vlog, open up the 3D files that my uh, friend's friend had sent me earlier this last week, which I haven't even gotten to because I've been so obsessed with AFK Journey, but I am hitting a paywall, so now I have the real game which is just AFK. <laughs> um, but yep, yeah, that's what's on the agenda today. Looking forward to taking you guys with me and uh, yeah, let's, let's see what goes on this lovely Sunday. For lunch, we had Kin Craft Ramen and Izakaya. 
but they weren't serving yakitori during lunch, so I opted for some sesame mazamen. We also got the honey butter chicken wings to share. My cousin's boyfriend encouraged me to get a drink, and since I couldn't say no, I got a lychee margarita. The lunch was good and it was nice to catch up with her and get to meet her boyfriend. He's got the pass in my book. Afterwards, we went to Long Black Coffee and I got to try their iced pistachio cream latte. A bit too sweet for my liking, but I would definitely get it again if I'm ever in the area. That was all for the first week of April. Thank you all so much for tuning in and hollow at you later.